Hello and welcome back. So now we're looking at the communication aspects of the TASH dashboard. Now, in the communication areas we have, there are several, but the one that I'm going to focus on here at the moment is your uh, direct communication and rather than indirect communication, which we'll go into when we come to the workbook. Now, when I click on this bell item at the top, sometimes you'll see there's a red dot in it, which means there's an alert for me. You'll see that I go into what we call conversations. Now, any message that comes to you from a mentor or in occasion, if you've got it set up that way, another student will come to your conversations and your conversations. You see here you have different people who are able to write and message you. And the only difference with our messaging service than anything else you would use is when you start a conversation here, not only can you obviously pick the person that you want to, to send to, like a directory, and this would only be maybe your mentors, obviously the way they set it up, and you can type what you think, but I can also put, um, so I am having trouble understanding this. And what you do then is automatically any of the videos that we have in our library are available to you here. So you can actually have this in a set so you can actually question some of the items in this video. Halfway through this video, I did blah, 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 blah. And so it really helps to send that uh, as a learner to a mentor so they understand where you are. But also in the reverse, if you're in a situation where as a mentor, you want to send something to a student or you've seen something in the class and you think this might help them. Again, you've got all the videos there ready and available to send. Now, in the space that we call conversations, you will also find feedback from your tutors comes to this section. You also find that any schedules set come to this section as well. So you've got that all available to you that you can use uh, and access. And that's how you can uh, start communicate from 